There's a lot of singularities about our home, Earth, so today you can join us to discover all these curious facts. Welcome to What the World. Today, we'll see some of the most famous abandoned places in Thailand. Like we always say, if you like this type of video, we invite you to subscribe and drop a like. We would really appreciate it. Thailand, known for its vibrant cities, stunning beaches, and rich cultural heritage, also has its fair share of abandoned places. These locations, while often neglected and left to decay, carry an eerie charm and attract adventurous explorers and urban enthusiasts. Here are a few notable abandoned places in Thailand. The Galaxy Ship The Galaxy, also known as the Ghost Ship, was the main attraction of a hotel complex situated in the southern part of Koh Chang. It was an idyllic place with the calming sounds of waves and winds rustling through the coconut leaves. The galaxy was the brainchild of a man with a brilliant idea of building a concrete cruise ship just a few meters away from a deserted beach. The seven-story boat had 70 luxuriously equipped rooms, including lifts, carpets, large chandeliers, highly trained staff, a lagoon view, and a swimming pool situated at the base of the boat. Despite having many attractions, nothing worked out for the complex. Overnight, the complex was shut down, the staff was laid off, and the doors were locked. The only entrance was through some closed windows, which soon became a hub for cats and urban exploration enthusiasts. Even after several years of its closure, nothing seemed to have changed about the galaxy. The boat still stands outside in a clear and well-maintained space. Inside, the situation's no different. The beds in the rooms are still furnished with their mattresses and bolsters, only lacking sheets. The bedside tables are covered with a thin layer of dust. The carpets in the corridors are damp, giving off a heavy atmosphere charged with a pungent and allergenic smell. Seepage here and there discolors the walls, which are gradually rotting. The kitchens are still equipped and nothing is visibly damaged. Only time has taken its toll. Building in Thailand is a serious business, with the final say not resting with the owner, but with the astrologer who approves, modifies, or provides solutions to the plans. It's surprising to many that a foreigner cannot be an architect in the land of smiles, but can only collaborate. According to local history, the galaxy was not sunk by bankruptcy, but rather by a lack of respect for the sacred site on which it was built. Two mistakes were made. The first mistake was the uprooting of a sacred banyan tree, which had always been venerated as it was the place where many wild elephants congregated. Cutting down the tree was not just an act of violation against the spirits that lived there, but also against the elephants, who are sacred animals in Thailand. Although this grouping of gregarious animals may not seem extraordinary to a novice, it was a particularly symbolic event for the local population. Destroying this place was seen as an offense to these emblematic animals. Transforming a sacred space without a purification ritual and without taking into account local beliefs creates disorder and desolation. Any accident that occurs in this place is no longer fortuitous, but considered revenge and destiny. There's nothing that can be done about such sacrilege. The other story that emerges is that of the accumulation of accidents. There were no fatal accidents, but a succession of small events that made the boat a cursed place, a place that was an Eden for the newcomer, but a real hell for the person who worked there. Tourists fell, got sick, and staff members got hurt, and the accidents were harmless but repeated day after day, creating real malaise for the staff and even for outsiders who brought tourists to this part of the island. But what was the real trigger? What was the straw that broke the camel's back? Many say that a tourist's fall was the trigger, but it's difficult to know. In any case, the accumulation of bad news must have been a major factor in the rapid closure. We also have other famous abandoned places in Thailand, such as Sathorn Unique Tower. Located in Bangkok, the Sathorn Unique Tower is a 49-story skyscraper that was meant to be a luxurious residential complex. However, due to financial issues, construction was abruptly halted, leaving it incomplete and abandoned. Despite its unfinished state, the tower has become a popular spot for urban explorers seeking panoramic views of the city. The Ghost Tower of Bangkok Another unfinished skyscraper in Bangkok, formerly known as the New World Shopping Mall, is commonly referred to as the Ghost Tower. The construction ceased after the Asian financial crisis in 1997. While technically off-limits, adventurous individuals sometimes sneak in to explore the eerie corridors and witness the graffiti-covered walls. Swan Lum Night Bazaar Once a bustling open-air market in Bangkok, Swan Lum Night Bazaar now stands abandoned and overgrown. It was a popular shopping destination known for its food stalls, live performances, and variety of goods. However, the land was sold to a property developer, and the market was permanently closed in 2011. The area remains vacant, serving as a reminder of its former glory. It's important to note that visiting abandoned places can be dangerous and may be considered trespassing. Some locations may have restricted access or unstable structures. If you decide to explore these places, it's crucial to prioritize your safety and respect any local regulations. We really hope that you liked this video. Don't forget to drop a like and subscribe for more content like this.